Welcome to another Technical Corner. Today we're here with Olaf from Hexagon. Um, and Olaf, you've had a lot of experience with sheet metal fabricators over the years working to help them solve their problems. Um, and today we're talking about a brand new suite of tools that Hexagon has put together to help those sheet metal fabricators. So if that's one of, if, if that's one of you, make sure you keep watching. Now Olaf, what challenges do you think these fabricators are facing nowadays? So if you think about what these, these companies do, uh, they'd use laser cutting, bending, tube cutting to turn basic materials, sheets, tubes, and fasteners into everything we see around us, basically. It could be anything from vehicles to appliances and to machinery. Now the key is here in the middle, the very basic materials, and we also spend very little time on uh, changing those materials. So we may cut them to size and cut some holes into them, but anything over a minute is already a long runtime. Now combine that with the constant need for change in the markets around us, and that means that the pressure on the, the, the series is getting greater. Uh, that puts a unique pressure on this, this market, basically. Yeah, and, and that pressure exactly, what is it in terms of volumes, times, cycle times, and margins as well on the products they're making? Yeah, that's right. So the margin of a component is usually all rolled up into a tiny percentage. So most of it is the material, and then tiny percent of added value, as we call it, about 10% or so. And that's what you've got to play with. That means there's very little time for, for extras, for errors, for uncertainty in the process, basically. And that's what we're trying to capture with the hexagon suite of, uh, of sheet metal products. Absolutely. So playing with that 10%, mm. um, what can you offer uh, companies from, for, the, for the whole process they, they, I guess they employ inside their fabrication shop? That's right. So like I said, margin for error is very small. So it all starts before the quote comes in. So looking to see whether you can safely offer the service to the customer is where it starts. And we've got great products around it to quickly analyze a product and say, okay, yes, you can do this with your standard tooling. You're okay to proceed. We can do that in instant. And then the quoting process starts. Okay, the pro quoting process has to be fast. It has to be automated uh, and it has to be consistent. But most of all, it has to be safe. Yeah, because we can't quote for something and then later find out that we need to buy special tooling or, or we needed a few extra just to calibrate the machine. There's just no, no, no space to do that. So you need to capture all the knowledge of the production manager or the production engineer that knows what that shop is capable of, um, but be able to do that automatically. That's right, yeah, because the, 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 the specialists on the shop floor, they, they, they shouldn't be involved in the quoting process. We should be able to capture their knowledge, their experience, and do the, the, the mundane work up front and make sure that when it hits the shop floor, they can focus on keeping the production running and get this job out in time. Brilliant. It sounds like it helps with um, a growing shortage of these specialists who can run the machine tools, the press breaks. They're quite complicated jobs and it's hard to find good people that can do those as well. Yeah. Uh, yeah what what right. else when you go further down in the process, let's say you've won the quote, mm -hmm. what happens, um, what, what, what can heck is going to help with in this suite of tools? So when, when these, these quotes turn into orders and they're, they're, they're relatively short, uh, short cycle, uh, cycle times and series, we try to combine them to make the most out of the material. Now we, we have by, by far the, the best nesting software in the, in the, in the market to help with that. Uh, but then the complexity afterwards is also really important to be able to address. Because in the end, off the machine comes this baking hot material and somebody has to sort out, okay, this was part A for customer so-and-so and we need to combine them back. So having consistent information all the way through is absolute key for, for this process to work. Yeah, imagine when you shake out those parts from the, from the sheet, they go everywhere and you need to collect them all up, make sure you're sending the right parts to the right customer. That's right, because the strength of material usage and, and, and uh, reducing your, your carbon footprint with it is in combining these orders, but you're increasing, increasing your complexity and the only thing you can deal with, uh, can combat that with is, is having consistent data all the way through. Yeah, absolutely. So once you're quoting, you're winning orders and you're making good parts that's getting sent to the right customer with the right quality, mm -hmm. um, that's a process you have. Um, and you want to optimize that process and can Connection help with that as well? Yeah, so we always measure. We always measure all the way along. So for example, our logistics systems have a retrospective option. So you can see, you have the system calculate what exactly as cost you've incurred for a certain job. So you can go back and make sure that you quote better next time. Uh, we also have systems in place to monitor your machine, machine tool usage. So where we try to combine the, the jobs on offer, did we do that in the right way for the entire stream? 
uh, is something that you can easily find out with our products. Absolutely. And what, what about when it comes to the actual cutting process, the actual manufacturing, how you manufacture that part with your cam system as well? Um, is there something important that people should know that they could actually try and improve in the way they cut their laser, laser cut components? Yeah, so when, when we apply cutting technology, especially for the, 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 the 2D cutting, uh, with these machine tools becoming more powerful and faster, it's important to, to, to create a secure process. That means that we need to capture anything that could potentially go wrong in the cut or uh, parts flying around. Uh, so we make extremely safe toolpath, very efficient, and we do this completely automatically. There's no user that tells that needs to do anything. We put rules in place. So okay, we need to avoid the heat buildup during this job for this material and thickness. We will always do that automatically and create a very safe and efficient toolpath that is repetitive, whether whether there's an operator at the machine or not. So that's a full suite of tools Hexagon have designed with sheet metal fabricators in mind, helping you to solve the challenge that you're facing today and for the coming years. Um, Olaf, is there, if there's any more information that sheet metal fabricators want to find out, um, how can they? Yeah, there's plenty more information about the Hexagon sheet metal suite on our website. Um, uh, follow us for more.